guys, now we're leaving out of home number seven, going into home number eight. I was trying to think of the uh, the Spanish number. Yeah, yeah, what she said. There we go. Yeah, that, that word. All right, so we are going into home number eight. So they done kind of switched it up on us a little bit. We got like a little, I don't know if that would be like a pinkish or... Or what type of color, but you don't normally see that on the Clayton home. You don't normally see that. You go, you. All right, guys, so this is home number eight. Let me back up a little bit more. There we go. Home number eight. All right, let's get it, man. Let's see what this home has to offer. This has been nice, man. Again, guys, we are out here at Clayton Homes in Statesville, North Carolina. All right, Statesville, North Carolina, Clayton Homes, and this is home number eight. A little fire pit? No, I'm joking. I'm messing with y'all. Messing with you guys. All right, y'all know how I feel about stairs, man, but I do appreciate it. Look, they're trying to make sure that, you know, we don't lose our footing when we're going up these stairs. Nice, open living room. Okay. Talk to me then. They even went out their way to add a little fake TV in here. We appreciate that. It's a nice little touch. All right, so this is going to be the master. All right. So we're going to come over here. And ladies and gentlemen, this right here is your living room. And it looks like it's, yeah, pepper with, with lights. Pretty, it's pretty decent. You got a light on every corner almost. All right. When you walk in, you're greeted with carpet. Definitely appreciate that. Definitely appreciate that. All right. So the master bedroom is that way. So you guys already know we're going to be going this way. All right. Hopefully you guys did not see that price. Don't rewind the video. Don't rewind it. All right. So this right here is the dining room right here. The dining room area. You have a window right here got a little rug right here y'all gonna be sliding all over the place all right you got some lights up above right here all right and we're gonna go ahead and walk into the first bedroom see how much space we got oh okay nice and open i tell you what they're actually putting a lot more drywall in, in these homes and i definitely appreciate that man definitely appreciate that you got the lights up top, you got the window over there. You have one vent over there, and it's close to the wall, which I do appreciate. All right, you also have outlets over there, walk in closet. All right, pretty decent space, don't you think? I think this is, yeah, this is pretty, pretty nice when it comes to, to the space. Definitely appreciate that, man. This this room is actually pretty decent. All right? So this is room number one. All right? Appreciate that. Smart thermostat, okay. Eco B, we see you. All right, this is room number two. Room number two. And you do have a vent right here. All right, you got a window right here. You got lights up above. All right, and this is a closet. Y'all, for a second, I really thought that the, uh, the bathroom was gonna be over here. I really did think that the bathroom was gonna be over here. <laughs> All right. Nice little walk-in closet. All right, this is the room. All right, and across the hallway is actually where they have, you have the back door right here. Across the hallway is where they have that breast bathroom, okay? They could have easily did two sinks in here, easily. All right, let's see, do we got any lights in here? The lights, all right, okay. So you do have the shower and tub combo right here. We got three lights, 
One is over the shower. One is on one side. Well, I mean, I guess that makes sense because it's not too sinks over here. All right, and then you have the toilet right here, and then you have empty space. You got empty space back here. Okay. Interesting. All right. Back into the hallway and up. <laughs> now, we're going to go ahead and head straight into the master bedroom. This is actually a really, really quick uh, video. A lot quicker than I thought. All right. So, now we're inside of the master bedroom. Mm, okay. All right. Uh, the decor in here is interesting. All right. Got the vents over here on the floor. No vents on the ceiling. You have the windows right here. Go ahead and put our backs to this wall so you guys can get a look-see on what the master bedroom looks like. Full drywall interior. Full drywall interior. Again, we do appreciate that. You got two lights up above. Now, let's walk straight into the bathroom and see what we got. Okay. All right. So, we got the his and her sink. We got the windows right here. And we have a shower. This is what I call the budget shower. That's the, uh, the cheap shower. I don't, I don't appreciate that, man. Don't appreciate that. You do have a window right here. But yeah, I'm not a fan of these showers at all inside of the master because I think that, again, this is just a, the cheapest budget option to go with. I, I'm good on that, fam. They could have they could have found a better way to utilize that space. You know what I mean? You could have just made a shower tub combo and I would have been a lot more appreciative with, with that than this. Anyway. You got the toilet right here, and this right here is the closet space. So it does separate. You got her side right here, and then you got her side, I mean his side, I mean her side. Yeah, right here for the clothes, and then you got a light in the middle. Definitely should have did a light on both sides. Yeah, I feel like they put this thing together real quick, fam, real quick. Did a good job with the drywall, but yeah, this bathroom was a mess. All right. All right, guys. So we're about to finish this thing up now. When you come out of there, you do have a, I guess this could be like a pantry closet. Maybe pantry closet right here. And then you come into here and you have washer and dryer. All day laundry today, naked tomorrow. What? I don't want to play. What, what, what's going on? What kind of video is this? What kind of home is this? All right. This is a uh, washer and dryer right here. I do. Uh, I didn't mean laundry. Oh, yes, you did. All right. So here we go right here. These are the cabinets. And we have Frigidaire appliances. Got the uh, the microwave. I mean, not the microwave, but the uh, the stove, dishwasher, and you have the sink separating. Uh oh, okay, that's a nice little touch. Okay, window right here, cabinets. All right, and that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Besides this nice little island right here, I do like the uh, the little black. That's a nice little nice little touch. And the, uh, the little bar stools down here. Nice little touch. All right, guys. What do you guys think about this particular home? All right. I'll give my, my insight on this thing afterward. But I would say a home like this definitely better be around 70, maybe 70,000, something like that. I didn't really see anything that kind of sticks out that makes this home over 100K. But y'all let me know what you guys think. How much, how much do you think? Quick little price. Uh, what do you think about this, this particular home? Me? Yeah. Well, well, well. 
You said what now? Quick little, of yeah, a quick a quick little price of what you think this home might be. Um, probably eighty thousand dollars. Okay, all right. So, what do you guys think? What what do y'all what do y'all think the price of this home is? All right, jump roll. <laughs> Bam. Bring it in. There we go. All right. For the three bed, two bath, 1,474 square foot home, $115,801. Uh, wow. Yeah. I don't know about that. This is the Concord? This is this is the Concord? All right. For the livery call setup. Wait, please see home consultant. Okay, okay. Gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Rebates may be available. It better be something available. Some type of rebates available for this thing. Um hundred and fifteen. I couldn't I couldn't go with that, man. Couldn't go with that. Uh think that might be a little bit too much for this particular home. I don't really see anything that necessarily like stands out. <laughs> <Just this. laughs> oh, how it's set up. Yeah, yeah. I don't I don't really see like I don't see like a wow factor, you know what I mean? Like anything that you know, I haven't seen in any other home or anything that again sets this home apart from those other homes that are around the 70 to 80,000 mark in South Carolina. I don't know. Y'all let me know, man. What do you guys think? down below in the comments about this particular home. Would you be willing to pay $115,000 for this home? Do y'all think that it's worth it? Y'all let me know. All right. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.